Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for uh, any time in December. I am going to do weeklies for December, so stay tuned for those. It's going to be you and the other person. I'm going to do a little bit different, differently. Anyhow, so what do we have for Capricorn for any point in December? What do we have for Capricorn? Let's start right here. We have the Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for December. Firm Foundation. So this is the Four of Pentacles. So somebody is working on their stability, trying to work on their stability, building up their stability. Maybe who's trying to save some money, holding on to money, trying to get some money, working on their foundation. So that's probably what you're focusing on this month is uh, building up a foundation. It doesn't have to be money. This person it looks like they're working on their physique, you know. So um, this is about getting grounded as well. Um, very, very strong, needing to, uh, probably needing to be frugal this month. That's the way I see it. Need to save, a need to persevere, a need to work really, really, really hard this month in regards to some sort of foundation, building a foundation or, um, obtaining, you know, success. So this is going to be some hard work. Somebody's going to need to really work hard to save and obtain stability and security. So that's going to be your focus. Your focus is probably going to be on stability and security this month. Um, your foundation, your home, your body, because your, your body is a foundation. So you may be focusing on your home, focusing on your health. Focusing on your bank account as well. Um, you know, holding on to your foundation, a stable foundation. So what do we have for Capricorn? What else? Health and home stability. Becoming stronger. The chariot. Now the chariot is all about movement, okay? And being very flexible by the looks of things. There's going to be, I don't know if somebody's moving. They could be moving homes because that is a foundation. Or their body is changing very rapidly because this is very fast. Things changing fast. We have somebody here that is a master. They, they are going to need to master their emotions. Um, typically the chariot is taking control. Somebody that has a lot of discipline. Needing to have discipline this month. You are going to need to have discipline by the looks of things. We got it in both of these cards. Discipline, willpower, your hard work pays off. Your hard work is going to pay off if you can find the discipline and the willpower and the self-control. You will uh, be capable of firming up your foundation if you are mentally strong enough to do so. And I feel like you are. I feel like you're going to be taking the driver's seat. I think you're going to be taking the lead. You're going to be taking charge. I feel like you are determined to be successful. And this month you may, you know, really be focusing on uh, achieving something. Focusing on your success. Now, the chariot can be moving. Like I said, packing up and moving home. So somebody maybe, you know... That may be in the cards this month. Um, whatever's happening, your hard work is definitely going to pay off if you have the willpower and the determination and faith as well. A couple cards fell out. I guess we're good with that because this is replacing fear with faith. You're going to need to have faith. Have faith in yourself. Have faith that you can do it. Have faith. Believe. You are strong enough. You are very capable of success. It's clear. So I see some forward movement here. Somebody's going to be moving forward. Oh, maybe we'll get one more since we have a, 
a house card. Let's get one more. There we go. Didn't want to go in, so we'll take it. Valley. <laughs> Interesting. Unbelievable. And it didn't want to go in. You saw what happened. I gotta get it, let it to focus. Deep personal strength and peace that assures success. Now I just got done saying basically all of that except for the peace part. You are going to need to find your deep personal strength to obtain success. And I, I said it in other words. So that is what's going to be happening this month. There's no doubt about it. Pale. Time to get out of a situation. And you will be getting out of a situation. I'm sure of it. Love. Love. So this has to do with love. So something to do with love. Love is going to be at the forefront. Now this could even be self-love. Okay. There could also be somebody coming towards you. Somebody coming towards you very fast. This could be a love connection. Could be a cancer. Could be a cancer, sun, moon, or rising. Okay. This could be somebody that you were in love with at one point or they were in love with you. This person could be coming in your direction. You could be moving in with this person. This person could be moving in with you. You guys could be firming up a foundation together. It doesn't have to be that way. You could also be doing this by yourself. Okay, we definitely have somebody in, in a driver's seat. You know, they're in charge. They're taking the lead. Um, you are going to be getting out of a situation. Now, I'm not sure if it's a home situation. It doesn't have to be. Um, it could be a relationship or somebody is getting out of a... It could be... Because these readings can always go vice versa. Somebody is going to be getting out of a situation that probably uh, steered them in the wrong direction. Okay, and then we have deep personal strength and peace that assures success. You are going to be successful. It's going to be a lot of hard work this month. You're going to be working hard. You're going to be moving in a new direction, moving very fast. Uh, there's a lot of perseverance here and there's a lot of mental strength. So I see you, or if it's not you, it's somebody else. We have somebody that is um, taking charge. That is for sure. Uh they're following their heart as well um, because the, the love is about heart. It's, and it could be self-love as well. But there is some sort of love here that is um, in the picture. A firm foundation that is building up a solid, stable foundation needing to be strong success is is coming you are going to be successful because you're being you're being so uh, you're not giving up you know this is what you want you're doing it there's nobody going to get in your way anyway you're going to be getting out of some sort of situation all is not as it seems there are some sort of hidden forces here Something is about to be shown to you. There is somebody that, or something, there's something has been hiding. Maybe they've been hiding their feelings. Somebody may have been hiding their feelings. Um, oh my God. This is an exciting, uh, fresh start. Just go for it. This is a, a match. Um, you may be, be dealing with a Pisces or a Cancer. Um... Anyhow, this is an exciting new opportunity. Just go for it. This is a match. Um, there's some sort of hidden forces here. Fear of the unknown. Somebody is very, very attracted. They are very attracted. They are very attracted to you. They've been hiding their feelings. They have, there's some sort of desires here. Somebody may be desiring to, and whether it's you or them, somebody has some sort of desire to uh, oh, let's get another card. What are they desiring? What do they want? What do they want? Move forward. Move. Something about moving. Somebody's moving. They may be coming. They're arriving. There could be an arrival. Somebody may be arriving. 
um, going to a better place, moving to a better place, a new exciting opportunity to move to a better place comes out of nowhere. So, what the hell? Um, there's an unclear and difficult path ahead, but you are going to see, you are going to see that it's time to go. You're going to get some sort of vision that it's time to go. There's, there's, there's something better for you. There's something better for you. I think that you may be in a troublesome situation. Maybe this is with a liar. You may be dealing with somebody who lies a lot. You know, that doesn't tell the truth. With that moon card. Somebody is hiding something. They're hiding something from you, but you're going to see it because that Ace of Wands is a new vision. There could also be a new spark or a new sexual partner here or, you know, a new desire. It's definitely a new opportunity that brings you to a better place because this is, this is leaving something behind that is very, very troublesome. You're going to be leaving something turbulent behind. This is very exciting, but I feel like there's, there's some sort of fear here. Fear of the unknown. I think that you should proceed with caution, but you should follow your gut as well. You're going to be needing to follow your gut. Now, this can always go vice versa. You may have somebody that is coming towards you. This is somebody that is following their gut. I also feel like you, 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 you know, um, you need to look a little bit deeper at a connection or somebody else is looking deeper at a connection. There's a lot of fear here. There's fear of the unknown, but I feel like you have an exciting opportunity to move on, to move, because this is moving on. The Six of Swords is moving on. It's going to a better place. You have an opportunity to go to a better place, and you're going to need to face your fears, okay? Um, now, I'm not sure if somebody's asking you to move in with them or something like that, or I, that could be the case. I don't know. Um, but, um, deep personal strength and peace that assure success. You're going to need to really listen to your intuition. Um, <laughs> strength reverse moving on. You may be moving on from a Leo doesn't have to be, but this is moving on from somebody that downplays you. You know, this is somebody who in controls you. Very, very controlling. Doesn't have to be a Leo. Can be any sign. Whoever this person is, this is somebody that is very, very controlling. Okay? This is somebody that is manipulative. There is somebody here that lacks respect from others or for others, not from. They lack respect for others and you need to move on from this person. This person um, may see you as vulnerable and they are able to control you. You're going to see something clearly about a person that is... Uh, very controlling this month. And I think you're going to be moving away from that person. Two of Wands reversed. And the Three of Pentacles reversed. Now this is lack of togetherness. Something not working out. Something isn't working out. Could be a third party situation. Somebody may have been working with an individual. But it's not working out. And there's going to be a departure. There's going, somebody may be leaving, they may be moving, um, going someplace else. It's just not working out. Um, there's a lack of compromise. There's a lack of communication. I'm not sure if you're dealing with a painter because we have painting here. This person may paint. You see all the painting going on? Um, there's, there's a lack of compromise as well. We have somebody here that refuses to compromise. Um, two of Wands reversed. Now, there could be a sudden departure or a sudden arrival. Could go both ways as well. You get twos. Twos are choices. So, either way, you're going to have to make some sort of choice, whether you want to stay or whether you want to go. And I think there's a fear. There's fear of change. There's going to be some indecisiveness. Okay, whether it's you or somebody else. Somebody may have been held back by an... Or, Somebody is or has been 
held back by another person that was trying to prove something. Definitely. Very egotistical. There's an egotistical individual here. Um, now that two of wands reverse is stuck. There's, there's there's a lot of it's choosing the safest option somebody was choosing the safest option but I feel like there's some sort of change that is coming we have somebody here that is taking charge they're ready it's like they're ready for movement they're ready for change they're ready to get out of a situation Somebody isn't on the same page with somebody that they have been working with or maybe even living with. They're not on the same page. And I feel like there's a new exciting opportunity. There's a match or there's a new opportunity that is more attractive, okay? There's a more attractive opportunity right here. Right, right, right here. Somebody has been stagnant they've been unable to choose but i feel like there's something that is going to happen something's going to be shown or seen or something that pushes somebody forward pushes somebody away from this controlling individual there's a lot of uh self-doubt here too there's a need to just go for it, whatever that means. Let go of your self-doubt. Don't let anybody hold you back. Believe in yourself. Believe in yourself. Let Definitely listen to your gut as well. It feels like, or, or whoever this is for, whether this is for the cross watcher or not, we have somebody here that isn't listening. They have not been listening to their gut. They've been choosing the safest option. I feel like they're in love with somebody else. Whatever that means. Anyhow, three of pentacles reversed. That's that's something not working out. A partnership that is not working out. So yeah, we have a partnership that isn't working out. I think there's going to be a departure. Okay. Um, Ace of Wands is an exciting new opportunity. It's a time of growth. It's a time of fertility. Um, it is. You get you may get this new new drive, this new desire to move away from somebody that has been controlling you. I know I'm repeating myself, but I don't know if it's a Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. It doesn't have to be, it can be anybody, but this person is miserable. This person is miserable. They loathe all the time. You have self loathing in both of these cards. This is somebody who um is very jealous. Very, very uh, envious. They may be envious of another person. Very manipulative. Uh, very hypersensitive as well. So you may be dealing with somebody that is very, very sensitive. They're sensitive to everything. Very needy. Very clingy. Okay? Um, I also feel like there's an individual here that hasn't been following their heart. Did I already say that? They need to follow their heart. And I feel like we there's going to be a sudden change. I think that there's going to be a sudden change of heart. Um, somebody may... Uh, I don't know. Somebody may be feeling guilty. They may be feeling guilty for not putting in effort when they should have. Um, Queen of Pentacles reversed. Oh my God. You're definitely dealing with somebody that is... Uh, very, very controlling. Very, very possessive. Uh, there's insecurity, jealous. You're dealing with a very jealous individual. Very, very, very jealous. Very controlling and manipulative. This is who you're moving away from. And I feel like there's another person here that is heartbroken. Um, that is probably waiting. Somebody's waiting. I don't know where that's coming from, but that's the way I feel. Um... Somebody is moving. They're moving to a better place away from a insecure individual that has been holding them down. Um, there is probably some financial issues as well this month. Um, you're going to really need to uh, be disciplined. And I mean really, really, really disciplined with your money. Do not give your money away. Hold on to your money. I think that money, you know, is an issue. 
this month. I think that, um, you know, you, maybe you need to save it. Maybe it's for a new place to live, you know, because of that foundation card and that chariot card and the six of swords. I feel like there's, there's a, a better place. There's a better place, but you're going to need to find your strength and you're going to need to find your courage and your willpower and your discipline to take back your power. It feels like somebody has taken your power. They've taken control of you and you've allowed it, you know? Um... Yeah, I feel like you it's almost like you're dealing with a green-eyed monster, you know. Uh this is somebody that is uh, uh disorganized, uh unhealthy. Uh this person may even uh scorn the world, you know. This is somebody who may think that they're better than everybody else. This person is very stubborn. You know, a hardliner. You're dealing with a hard, hardliner that is controlling you. Anyhow, uh, I feel like you need to, to love yourself. I feel like you need to leave all, and whether it's one person or two people or several people, I feel like you need to leave some people behind. And I hate to say that, but I feel like you have peace and harmony and serenity as soon as you choose. You choose to make a decision and stick to it because of that two of wands reverse is indecisiveness stick to your decision you have an exciting new life ahead of you but if you resist change you know and involve yourself with a third party that isn't working out you know and i, I don't know if somebody's dealing with their ex or whatnot and it's not working out then you're only doing that out of lack, lack of self-esteem lack of self-worth you know what i mean I think that you need to find your strength. I think that you need to master your emotions. If it's time for you to go, it's time for you to go. Okay? It is definitely time for you to get out of a situation. You have an exciting new life right in front of you. Um, you, may, you, may, you may want to start looking for another place to live. I don't know where that's coming from. But I feel like there's something to do with a foundation. Maybe it's your health. Maybe it's your body. Um... All is not as it seems. There is something that is that is below the surface that you have not seen yet that is about to show up. This is going to probably stop you right in your tracks. It's probably going to um, it may make you upset. It may make you upset. It may uh, make you excited. It could make you either way. It, it may push you forward. You know, there's been some sort of delay. There's something that is that has been below the surface that you haven't found out yet that is about to be shown, okay? It's about to be shown to you. Um, we'll get one more card. I think you've been playing it safe. You've been staying in a safe situation. And it's time to go. It is time to go. Stop wasting your time. Stop wasting your time working with somebody who involves you in third parties or... Hold, controls you and this could go for the this could go for the cross watcher somebody is being controlled by an individual that they don't love or they don't love them you know vice versa whatever because there's no love here it, it could be a sexual connection and that's it Make a decision and stick to it. Stick to it. And, and I think that if it's not you making the decision, it could be somebody that you're dealing with. Somebody is going to be making a decision. And there's going to be no changing of the mind. Okay? A new perspective is coming, put it that way.
I think there's going to be a conversation. Somebody's going to be using their head. I feel like uh, you're going to be receiving some challenging information that really uh, brings you clarity. Put it that way. You're going to see something completely, 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 completely different. Um, somebody's going to be saying something that gives you a new perspective. You may see something. You're going to be receiving some challenging information that doesn't make you happy. Or the other person is, if it's somebody that is coming forward towards you. Somebody is going to be not happy. Or they're not happy. And they're, they're putting something to a stop. Somebody is putting something to a stop. It's not working out. There's going to be a sudden departure. I feel like somebody hasn't been following their heart as well. They're going to be following their heart towards something better. So I feel like this month you can be prepared for to receive some challenging information. I think it has to do with a, you know, uh, I don't know, a third party. And then third party could be anybody. Okay, it could be an ex. Somebody's been lying. They haven't been telling the truth. They've been hiding something. And the truth is all going to come out. Good luck. And don't forget to subscribe. Next week's are going to be about uh, you and the other person. Good luck.